we've given water, we've made sure there's enough water being supplied to these communities. Uh, as we speak today, Aveime water pump station, which was submerging water, at least we provided new water, new pumping station to pump water to ensure water is restored to the, com the community of Aveime. Uh, if you go to Mepe, at the Kins Kizito, uh, St. Kizito School, uh, also um, uh, set up a, a new uh, purifying system. That is a borehole system with a purifying um, uh, a filtration system to give, uh, to give the community uh, filtered water to drink. Um, as at uh, Sunday, working with ECG, we've restored electricity uh, to the King, uh, Saint Kizito uh, School, another three uh, affected, three safe events in the in the Amepe community. Um, today, because uh, uh, transportation across the Mepe area is a bit difficult, we constructed a new uh, road from Mepe to Bato to allow access into Mepe. Uh, that road is about five kilometers. That one is also. Uh, done. Our hospital department, in conjunction with the Ghana Health Services in the various districts, we supplied almost 1.5 million Ghana cities worth of drugs to the communities. Um, we have our environmental uh, department who are also in the communities working with the, with the people affected. Um, as said, uh, we'll continue to make sure we bring this relief to the, the doorsteps of all those affected, those in the safe havens and those staying with the friends and relatives. Um, we've, last Tuesday, we also went through the community to find out what additional things that they really need, which we're also compelling to send more of uh, mosquito nets and what have you. Those ones are also started going as I speak today. Uh, some of our directors who are working on the ground are making sure these items go to the various communities. We'll continue to do this and make sure that the relief that the communities need, they get it. And make sure also they return back to their normal life, restore the livelihood that they've, they've suffered as of today, and um, work with government and ensure that whatever restoration has, needs to be done will be done accordingly. 20 million is money given initially. As the situation unfolds, uh, VI will still maybe add up to the money to make sure the relief that we've promised to give these communities, they get those released.